Hello folks, welcome to another Throwback Thursday, and today on Throwback Thursday we're going to talk about a movie, a movie that came out 10 years ago, actually sorry, 20 years ago, and it's none other than this movie that was made by Disney called Mulan. Now, here's the funny part, it's like, this movie freaking devastated me as a kid, okay? Let me just tell you about that. It's like, yeah, this is the real reason why I made this is that Mulan ruined a freaking word for me. And if anyone says that word, it's just cringe worthiness, and that's just how it goes. So for people who don't know what Mulan is, Mulan actually is a Disney film where you have a Chinese girl named Mulan who actually takes the place of her father when it comes to war. So she goes, she gets trained, she does a few things, and eventually she gets wounded. As soon as she gets wounded, they find out she's a woman. And then they leave her behind in the snow while they continue to go. And then eventually we have this showdown of where the bad guy and a few other of the bad guys actually are in a town. And she confronts them along with the three other men who actually she befriended. So they actually take him down, and of course, well, he get, she gets to have his, her father's blessing, the fact of, I wouldn't ever have a daughter like you. You are a great daughter. He's like, you know, it's just that part. I, that's, I think that's the gist of everything. So rewinding back for people who actually is like, okay, well, what freaking chastised you as a kid? What freaking wrecked crap? Oh, it's the part of when they were like, she's a woman. And my eight-year-old self, I asked, how the frick did they know that she was a woman? Or technically, I just ask, how did they know that she's a woman? And well, sadly, my mom said that word, B-O-O-B-I-E-S. in the most craziest word, way possible and because she said it like that i will never say any word affiliated with that word so b-o-o-b not gonna ever say it b-o-o-b-s not gonna say it b-o-o-b-i-e not gonna say it and of course the one with you know all the freaking word letters in there i would never say it and not to throw someone under the freaking bridge, but I have to do it. Um, Scotch Quatch's wife, she says it all the damn time. <laughs> no, she says it a few times at the end of the freaking... It's like, whatever time she gets, she's going to say it. And that's just always a cringeworthy part of where it's like, oh... <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's the sucky part. It's like, yeah, I don't want to hear that word. I don't ever want to hear that word ever again. But, of course, you know how it is, is that you're most likely going to hear that freaking word. And, of course, since we turned this to a kind of sexual whatever video, some might even ask, what about the word tetas, tatas, tits? I'm fine with it, but it seems those words are also pretty stupid. At least the good news is that I don't have any freaking home wrecking <laughs> moment with those words, so I can say them. It's just that I won't really say them because, again, they sound pretty stupid. I mean, for some weird reason today in this world, we pick freaking nicknames to call things that are sexual parts. And for me personally, I say all of them completely suck. I don't give a shit about those. It's like, yeah, I'm fine with just saying one letter. I'm fine with one letter words, one letter saying those, but, you know, all those other words, ta-ta, today's, and, oh, <laughs> your boing boing, <laughs> I don't say those, because, again, they're pretty damn stupid, so I'm not gonna say it, unless you actually have, like, a cool word that's like, yeah, that's, that's exactly what I'm gonna say it, like, crack or dickle, it's like those, those suck too. I was like, yeah, those suck too. I would never say those either. It's like freaking damn. Stop, stop taking an innocent word and turning it what the fuck evil. Okay. Like for instance, pussy. For instance, I know I said it, but it's like long time ago it was called pussy cat and pussy willow, and you're telling me that oh yes, yeah, we're gonna take that word and we're gonna turn it into a messed up word now. It's like oh, why? Why the fuck did you do that crap? I what about cock? 
It's like, yeah, you turn that word into a messed up word for some dumbass reason. Or what about gay, for instance? They took that word and turned that into something messed the frick up. It's like, guys, stop taking innocent words and twisting them, turning them into bullcrap. Okay? And of course, I don't have any freaking willpower or anything to do that. So there we go. And I guess the most pressing question is two things. Number one, did you watch Mulan 2? Yes, I did. Number two, are you going to watch the live action one? Most likely it's going to be a hell no. <laughs> it's like, yes, I was like, it's going to be a hell no. I am not going to freaking watch that damn movie just so I relive that moment that happened 20 years ago, which is most likely going to be 20 plus years ago when it comes out. Freak that sh No. No, I'm not doing it. Will I ever watch Mulan ever again? No, the only most likely time I'll ever watch it ever again is with children or with my own kids. But even then, I'm like, um, I gotta go do something right quick. <laughs> yeah, as soon as that freaking, <laughs> that freaking scene comes, I'm gonna be like, okay, kids, I'll be right back. I gotta do something. <laughs> Five minutes later. Okay, I'm back. Thank goodness we passed that freaking scene. <laughs> and hopefully my kids won't be kind of messed up where they're like, oh, we gotta pause this for her dad. It's like, if they do that crap, we'll be like, oh, son of a big why kids why did you pause that damn movie why did you pause it i don't want to see that freaking damn scene i don't want to see it uh, <laughs> but yes mulan an eight-year-old who was two years two years early to the party getting told what tatas is well you basically, you know, the B words, the, the B words. It's like, yeah, you get to understand what girls have that a guy doesn't have. And it's like, yeah, that's good. But my mom's delivery was what ruined that whole entire word for me. It ruined that whole entire word. All those words related to it for me. So, yeah, thanks, Disney. Thanks, Mulan. You freaking did a good job wrecking kids' freaking innocence on one thing. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Oh, my gosh, man. Oh, my freaking gosh. Oh, yeah. One side note before I go is the fact of, man, you had Jackie Chan. I'm not sure. I'm not sure in the English version Jackie Chan actually sung. But in the Chinese version, Jackie Chan actually sung, I'll make a man out of you. Yeah, so it's kind of cool to actually hear, oh, wow. So Jackie Chan actually sung in this movie. That was pretty, that would be pretty cool. Yeah, too bad that I think it was only the Chinese version and not English. So anyways, yeah, thank you for watching, folks. You now hear my pain. Of course, I know there's going to be lots of people who will be jerk bags and basically go down below and say the words that I don't want to hear. And for that, I say, hey, you're a jerk bag and I'm not going to freaking allow your comment to be seen. So just saying, I'm not going to allow your comment to be seen. So good idea. I mean, yeah, you're going to give me for three seconds and kind of like as if you hit me and I'm Jason and then Jason stunned and then he gets back up and something like that but anyways yeah don't be crazy just just allow me to just say this and be like there you go that's the reason why i don't say that word it was like this gosh watch whenever you see this video and of course if i did if you did see that video in this video it'd be kind of crazy like yeah wow really she's he saw it and he shared it with her and then she's gonna be like no she's gonna most likely be like oh yes if we're that special person out there yeah, she's gonna say that word. It's like, my gosh, what the fuck? <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> Thank you for watching, folks. Have a good Thursday.